you giving, that's how we live it Don't be mad at the system, it's simply how we've existed I hear a lot of people talking like they politicians And choose to be an accountant because it's safe and Hi y'all, welcome back to the channel Bass Box and Outdoors uh, Just want to start off by thanking y'all for uh, liking, subscribing And sharing and all that good th stuff, hitting the thumbs up uh, Today I've got a box for y'all that we're gonna look into. I've gotten these box before. Uh, normally they're really good boxes. They seem to put a lot of stuff in these boxes and the overall value of the box seems to be double of what you pay for the box. So those of y'all that are looking for a box that gives you a lot of fishing stuff but you're not really worried about like having like the best of the best then this would be a really good box for you. If you're just worried about like getting some uh, really good stuff and not having to worry about spending a whole lot for it, if you know what I mean, uh, this would be a really good box for you. If you're just worried about stacking up on uh, fishing tackle. So anyways, this right here is a mystery box, just like mystery tackle or monster bass. The only difference is it's not a monthly subscription. Basically, you go on there and you order whenever you want to, which is really cool. I try to go on there monthly and order one every month. I didn't do it last month. I just kind of wanted to take a little break from it. But anyways, so uh, Bass Casters is really cool. Uh, I've been fortunate enough not to get any of the same stuff in it in any of these boxes i've gotten but there is a chance that you might but usually if you do you get like the same bait a lot of times it's going to be a different color or something like that so you're not going to get the exact same thing uh but with that said like i said i've only gotten like one or two like crankbaits that were the same model but they were different colors so you know Anyways, that's something to keep in uh, mind whenever you decide to buy this box or, you know, they don't guarantee you different tackle every time you buy one. But like I said, if you do it month to month, I think you'll be all right. All right. So uh, this box with shipping and everything costs $43. Uh, their shipping is like a two to three day shipping. So you're not getting shipping free because they hurry up and get it to you. I ordered this box Friday and I'm getting it today. So pretty good deal. This is the uh, XL box. This is the biggest box they have. They also have one that's a little bit cheaper and I think it's like $35 with taxes. Uh, you can use the code, uh, bass 10 i believe and it'll save like 10 percent off or bass 15 or something like that there's a little code for you to use and it'll uh, a lot of times it'll pop up whenever you sign up for it it'll say use this code if you're a first time uh, customer and you can use it and save a little money but anyways let's dig into this and i'll show y'all what it's about like i said this is a big box i mean it's a lot bigger than monster bass boxes Okay, before I get into this, also I was thinking about doing something a little different, but I wanted to get y'all's uh, opinion on what y'all would think. I thought about maybe starting to open the boxes before I showed y'all and maybe do like a price check on each of the baits and stuff. And then that way, maybe I can give y'all an overall value of the box whenever I'm done with the video. That way I can tell you what the price of each bait is and then we could come up with the total price. Uh, let me know if that'd be something y'all were interested would be interested in me doing or would y'all just like me to keep it like it is right now and just you know open it up with y'all but anyways that's up to y'all just let me know what y'all think about it all right so let's get into this got a little receipt so okay so this box costed me 
4467 out the door. And the uh, coupon is BASS10. B A S S 10. I think there's also a 15. If you change it to a 15 instead of 10, I think there's another one on that one. All right. So, first up, we have a 3 16 ounce Booyah Mini Shed Spinner Bait. Okay, that's. A real interesting looking little bait right there. You don't see very many spinner baits with uh, three blades on it. Uh, yeah, mini shad. This is a chartreuse glimmer. Uh, like I said, three sixteenths of an ounce. Also, they don't do their boxes based on the season so don't go in there thinking you're going to get a winter box for the winter and then it be they do they're just they throw a whole bunch of stuff in a box and send it out so we're going to open this up and see what this is about this is pretty cool because i don't have a three bladed spinner bait i normally just buy the two blades but this one looks kind of cool because it's small it ain't real big. I mean, it's not like a real small one, like a little pond magic, but it's not too big either. So I really like that. As y'all can tell, I'm going to keep this because this is a one I don't have, but I want to show see like they have these little ones like this for ponds and stuff and this one's a little bit bigger so like i said it's a little bit smaller than a normal size spinner bait but that's real cool i like that it's got three three blades on it's got what two silver and a gold and uh the color of it's real nice too it's got that silver head with the little red gills on it little red eyes and it's got this little red bead on there so that's real nice but yeah i make some good spinner baits uh you got a single keeper or bait holder but all in all that's a good looking little spinner bait right there i like that i ain't ever had one like that i've seen them in stores for sale like the bigger ones but uh, I've never seen real small ones like that for sale with three blades on it. So that's pretty interesting. So, yeah, that'll work. And it's, I mean, right now is a good time of the year to actually use it. So, all right. That's bait number one. Bait number two. Booyah Bait Co the boo jig uh black and brown spice uh this is uh they don't have the thing marked they forgot to mark it i guess where it says the weight normally i put a little x or something up there to mark it but if i had to guess this right here is probably a uh, three eighths ounce of a jig, maybe a little bit heavier. Yeah, I thought it's about a three eighths. Nice looking jig. It's just a little flipping jig. Got a nice little head on it, big old open ring on it. It's got some rattles on it too. So yeah, all in all, just a nice looking little jig. Thought it worked real good this time of year. Good color to it, brown and black, called brown and black spice. So that ought to work good. Next up, we got some uh, Bobby Garland crappie baits. 
These are called the Slab Slayer in a pink and pearl white. First time I've ever gotten any like crappie lures in their thing, but. Okay, that's weird looking. A little weird looking tube jig looking thing. I don't know much about these. I'm not much of a crappie fisherman, but they look like they would catch some fish, that's for sure. It's like, I don't know. That little thing got a weird little suction cup thing going on in there. Y'all can tell. It ain't hollow body, but I don't know. That's weird. But anyways, these are uh, three inches long, solid body. Lively cup spear tail. Recommended for a 1 16th ounce jig or a 3 16th ounce jig. And that's a 10 pack. Yeah, that's the first time I've ever gotten any like little jigs like that in here. All right, next up we got some uh, 1 4th ounce war eagle jig head jig head worms uh these are green pumpkin uh new warhead eagle jig head worm designed by the pros for tough fishing slightly recessed eye collects less debris and allows for a better hookup huh and that's another thing about them they don't send you just like fishing bait sometimes they'll send you like pliers or something else anything that has anything to do with fishing might end up in your box i've gotten pliers i've got snips i've got a little bit of everything really it's a nice little flat head on the top got that little recessed eye they were talking about not bad can't ever go wrong with hooks that's a uh, sit five pack but them things are pretty expensive too war eagle pretty expensive normally all right so next up i've gotten this before this is uh the track down ghost minnow uh made by rebel and basically this is just a little old jerk bait tennessee shed i'm not gonna open that up because i'm gonna put this in the giveaway box for y'all uh but yeah like i said i've had it on here before i've got it over in my box it's a little rebel track down ghost ghost minnow is what they call it but uh Anyways, that's interesting. I'm going to put that in the giveaway box. Next up, we have these uh, half ounce War Eagle Custom Super Spoons. That'll be going in the giveaway box too because uh, I don't use spoons. So somebody will be happy to get these, I guess. I just, I don't care to spoon fish. I can open this one because it's, uh, I can put it back together. But anyways, here's the spoon. Run it. There really ain't much to say about a spoon. I mean, it's a spoon. <laughs> Got good colors on it. Seems to be made real, real well. So, there ain't nothing wrong with that if you like the spoon fish. But I don't like the spoon fish. So, that'll definitely be going in the giveaway box as well. So, that's uh, two more items we've added to the giveaway. Also, I'm also thinking about maybe doing a weekly giveaway if y'all are interested in something like that. 
maybe doing a uh, a uh, like a uh, one bait a week giveaway or something. I thought about doing something like that. Let me know if y'all think y'all would be interested in something like it. All right, so this is something I don't have. This is a bomber all water jointed wake minnow. This one's in green mackerel. Real nice looking bait. Like I said, these two are going to give a wave hole, so I'm going to throw them over. Made by Bomber. Nice looking bait. Got sticky hooks. And as y'all can see, it's just a little jointed, basically jerk bait. But they say it's a weight bait, so it's going to stay right below the surface or right on top. Real nice color. I like it. It's almost like a fire tiger, except it don't have no orange to it. It's real nice. It's got big old eyes on it. It's got the gill plate, little fins on there. Nice bait. I like it. All right, there you can roll right around on the top of the water and catch all kinds of top water action bites if they're biting on the top water. Be a good bait to throw. So yeah, that's uh, that. The jointed wake minnow from Bomber. All right, so next we got a half ounce. Booyah one knocker. Uh, I'm not going to open this up either because I've got one of these. These are the perch. This will be going in the giveaway box as well. Real nice bait. Anybody that knows anything about rattle traps, you know the Booyah one knocker. Really, really good bait. Probably one of the best lipless you can get other than like a rattle trap or something like that. All right, next up we got a three-fourths ounce War Eagle Custom Lure. And that right there is a really nice spinnerbait. Nice color on it too. It's a double willow leaf. Uh, bleeding Shad is the color. I love me some War Eagle spinner boots, by the way. And this is a color I don't have, and that thing is nice. Okay. That's kind of weird. I don't know if y'all have ever seen one like this that's got that weird thing right there where you're not going to be able to put a trailer on there. But it's a real nice color to it. Uh, so you got a silver and a gold. And everything on here is gold. Real nice. It's got a little bit of chartreuse, some white with all these little, little specks of uh, red in there. Looks like it's bleeding. It's got two or three solid red ones. I mean, there, there ought to be a slayer. Nice, nice color. I really like that. I know that's going in my tackle box. spinnerbait from War Eagle. Alright, last but not least. I do not have one of these. This is the Spro Rat. BBZ1 Rat 30. 
uh, it's a half ounce, three and a quarter inch long, uh, triple threat. It's a waking and walking action, interchangeable tail section, deep thumping sound, lifelike appearance. Uh, from what I understand, uh, this is a weight bait. From what I've understood, definitely interesting. I like I said, I don't normally buy mice to fish with. Hmm. That's definitely interesting. I know these right here cost twenty dollars online. Actually, twenty dollars about anywhere you look. I do know that. So this right here, this one bait, is half the cost of this box. So that can pretty much tell you how much value is going to be in this box. It's a real nice jointed bait. I mean, a wake bait. I mean, I don't see why it wouldn't catch fish. They eat mice, so that's interesting. Mice probably, a mouse probably wouldn't be my number one pick to fish with, but that's me. And it gives you a little interchangeable tail. That you can replace. So, and you know, Spro is a big name brand. You can't go wrong with Spro either way, so. Oh, and that right there is called the Gray Ghost Rat. So yeah, that's uh, interesting. So anyways, that's the box, yo. So we got, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. So, for those of y'all that don't know, this is, uh, like I said, it's just go to BassCastersUSA.com and uh, you can get one of these boxes. Like I said, it's not a monthly subscription. Uh, if you order this box today or tomorrow, you're probably going to get the same box that I got. If you don't want this box, I would wait till next, the beginning of next month and then you'll probably get a different one. Like I said, these three lures are going down here in the box. I've got a giveaway box down there. I'll just give you an idea of how much stuff I've got. All that's giveaway stuff. That's why I was saying I was thinking about doing like a weekly giveaway of one pack of baits or something like that and I could mail it off to you or something like that. But anyways... That's this month's box. Uh, I'll probably go ahead and get a next, another one the beginning of next month. Let me know what y'all think about the box. Box good. Uh, would you buy this box? Uh, me, myself, I like it. Uh, that's why I keep on getting them. Uh, they, like I said, most of the time you get like 14 items in the box. I'm wondering if they did 10 this time because of that mouse i know i looked up the price of that mouse and it's 19.99 so that might be why they didn't because that the price of probably four baits anyways so probably why they only sent 10 items this time but 10 items is still good i mean that's two more than what you get out of monster bass or mystery tackle box at the same price so anyways uh thank y'all for watching i uh, hope y'all enjoyed and i'll see y'all on the next one